Seven News following two breaking stories. Right now, several people injured in the 4300 block of Lapan after being doused with a flammable liquid and then set on fire. A news tracker on the scene of a second breaking story. A robbery attempt at 32nd and Champa, and once again, police say, a possible flammable liquid was used. But investigators aren't saying if the incidents on Lapan and Champa are connected. Seven News crews are on both scenes, and we start with Marshal Zellinger live with the bizarre attack on Lapan. Mike, police left here just within the hour after a good two hours of investigating a crime involving chemicals from a bug sprayer. We're told it happened in that left side doorway of this near apartment. Police tell me two men went to that doorway and sprayed chemicals from a bug sprayer on four people inside, then either lit a match or used a lighter to set them on fire. Around 8.45, we watched investigators bring out multiple silver cans filled with evidence. Uh, there was one piece of evidence still on the street with a evidence marker, and when the investigators the investigator picks it up. It appears to be some sort of stiff, charred clothing. Now, we know the woman who answered the door at the home is the one who called 911. She's now in critical condition at a hospital's burn unit. Three others inside were also taken to the hospital with minor burns. And the police say the weapon used is especially concerning to them. Let's talk about the bug spray real quick. That's right. not something you're commonly going to see somebody walking around carrying. So if you've seen somebody walking around this evening carrying a bug sprayer uh, in the area, in this area, uh, let us know. We'd like to hear from you. Police tell me this was not a robbery, but they do not actually know the motive just yet, and they classify this crime so far tonight, quote, highly unusual and extremely scary. Reporting live in Denver, Marshall Zellinger, 7 News. News Tracker 7 at the scene of more breaking news. This is a live picture at 32nd and Champa, where police are investigating another fire involving a flammable liquid. Witnesses say they saw men with something that looked like a fire extinguisher running from ACE check cashing. That's what they told us just 30 minutes ago. We noticed a smell that smelled like burning plastic. We came around to the front of the building and noticed that there's a lady, well, actually the employee of the check cashing place. She was trapped in the enclosure where she works. There was a cloud of smoke, um, and the counter was on fire. She said that she could not get out, but I just wanted to get away from the flames because they were creeping towards her because the floor was on fire and the countertop was on fire. That clerk told them she hit the panic alarm and then couldn't get out herself. She eventually ran out of the building. Police not connecting these two cases yet, but we are still investigating.